On March 7, 2013, a YouTube account was created, but the account didn't post its first video until about six months later on September 23, 2013. This account has a total of 624,774 videos, with each video posted consecutively anywhere on average from 1 minute to 15 minutes after the next, but never more than one hour. This string of video posts continued for over a three-year period. The duration of almost every video is only 10 seconds long, with the exception of four outlier videos. A majority of the first videos posted all had the same title of just one word. Aqua. The content in each 10-second video is nothing more than red and blue rectangles flashing and moving all over the screen in random directions and sizes on a white background, accompanied by an electronic tone as background music. Although one interesting thing about the patterns of these rectangles is that whenever one of the rectangles crosses over the other, the red rectangle is always over the top of the blue one. Here is the first video ever posted by the web driver Torso account. These videos became what is known as the Web Driver Torso Mystery, and this mystery and its many explanations is the subject of today's video. On the surface, the video seemed pretty harmless. Weird, sure, but YouTube is filled with things a hundred times more bizarre. However, the video was still compelling. Most of the Web Driver Torso videos follow exactly the same structure, except for four. There's one video that's a Rickroll where at the 0.05 second mark, a dancing red silhouette of Rick Astley is briefly shown. There's another one titled 00014 that shows the lights of the Eiffel Tower at night, and then quickly captures the screen of someone's laptop screen. There's another one that you can only view if you live in France, and you also have to pay a fee to view it. This video features a dub of an episode of Aqua Teen Hunger Force. This may reference to why the titles of the first several videos posted only say Aqua. Then another video, the Eiffel Tower video in fact. In the comments section there was a comment by the web driver Torso account itself, the one and only comment the account has ever made on one of their videos, and it said, Matei is highly intelligent. This comment was made even more mysterious by the fact it was deleted very soon after it was posted. However, on March 20th, 2019, they posted another video that was titled Web Driver Torso Matei is Highly Intelligent, and the words Matei is Highly Intelligent appear very briefly in the video, as shown here. So what did it all mean? Who was behind these thousands of videos and why? And who is Matei? Clearly there was something strange going on, right? Being the internet, there were of course many theories. One of the first was that the videos WebDriver Torso uploaded were a kind of number station for a modern age. If you're unfamiliar with what a number station is, it's a shortwave radio broadcast consisting of nothing but a repeating string of numbers. Some of the most famous number stations include the Lincolnshire Poacher from Britain and the Pip, Buzzer and Squeaky Wheel stations from Russia. Number stations are typically believed to be a way for intelligence organizations, or spies, to communicate with each other. The videos of the WebDriver Torso YouTube channel follow some of the same structure as a number station broadcast. The videos are, almost always, presented in exactly the same way, and the videos seem to contain a pattern that if you had a way to decipher it, could give you some information. Therefore, one of the first, and most logical conclusions as to the purpose of this mysterious channel, was that it was providing coded messages to spies. The theories didn't stop there though. Another popular theory involves the internet's favourite scapegoat, aliens. Some thought the videos, although virtually indecipherable to us, might actually be perfectly understood by beings from another planet. They thought that perhaps this was an attempt to get in contact with extraterrestrials, who for all we know have an entirely different way of communicating than humans do. 
Another of the more out there theories was that the outlines of the overlapping shapes in the videos were actually building construction plans. However, the person who proposed this theory, a YouTuber named Craig Lauren, did not actually provide any information as to who the construction plans were for or what they were actually building. Finally, one of the most compelling theories about the true nature of WebDriver Torso's videos relates to another internet mystery known as the Cicada 3301 mystery. In a brief summary, Cicada 3301 is a set of mysterious online challenges, supposedly designed to recruit those with a high IQ and a high level of technical knowledge. Many on the internet thought the videos posted by WebDriver Torso might be just another one of the Cicada 3301 challenges and those who knew exactly what to look for would eventually solve the puzzle. With so many theories and so few real explanations, the WebDriver Torso mystery captivated the internet for almost a year. Eventually, an answer was found. The real explanation for the WebDriver Torso mystery did not involve spies, aliens, construction plans, or recruitment to a secret organization. Instead, it just involved video quality assurance. A software engineer from New York named Isol Vargas noticed the videos the WebDriver Torso YouTube channel were uploading were very similar to ones he had seen at an automation conference. The videos Isol was referencing were made by a British company called UView and were intended to test whether videos uploaded to the internet and viewed on devices, such as set-top boxes, retained their quality well enough once compressed. While it was eventually discovered that UView wasn't behind the WebDriver Torso videos, the real purpose of the videos was very similar. It was eventually discovered by an Italian blogger named Soghetto Ventuno that the videos were uploaded by an account that was part of a network called UTUP Load Test Partner Torso. The purpose of the videos was simply to test YouTube's upload quality. The uploaded video was compared to the original to see if there was any loss of quality. Overall, it's a pretty boring answer to what was originally a very compelling mystery. YouTube's official statement about the WebDriver Torso videos was this. We're never going to give you uploading that's slow or loses video quality, and we're never going to let you down by playing YouTube in poor video quality. That's why we're always running tests like WebDriver Torso. This was a joke response referencing the song called Never Gonna Give You Up by Rick Astley. At least they didn't lose their sense of humour in their response to the public. Oh, and the identity of the mysterious Matei? Many people think Matei might be one of the people in charge of uploading the videos, but this has never been confirmed. And as for the Rick Roll video? Well, we all like to have a little fun at work sometimes, don't we? Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and turn on notifications for more interesting videos just like this one. If you're in the mood for more mystery, check out our YouTube page for a wide variety of mystery topics. Or if you're in the mood for something strange in the real world, check out our videos on the unsolved case of Alexis Sharkey or the mysterious case of Eliza Lamb. We'll see you in the next video.